So I'm starting off on freshly spritzed hair. Um, I don't think it's detangled. I think I'm probably re-detangling this. But I'm going to start off with my wide tooth comb. I used to use the wide tooth comb to sort of pre-detangle before I got in with my Denman. When I was using the Denman the quote unquote wrong way, um, using the wide tooth comb helped clear up some of the knots and otherwise I'd be combing my hair all one section all day long with the Denman. It took forever. So when I used my Denman, I used to use it perpendicular to my hair. Um, that was apparently the wrong way, and now I use it parallel to my hair. So I'm brushing parallel to my hair, which is basically holding the brush upright, starting from the bottom. So typically what I do is I start from the bottom and detangle. See, look, this is just taking so much quicker. But I start from the bottom and I go halfway up, at least halfway up, and I make sure I get through all the mats that way. Get through all the mats, loosen up the edge. And then going forward, what I do is then I start to go sort of from the top to the middle. So once I've um, combed out basically from the middle half to the top to the bottom, I start from the top and I comb down halfway. Um, to me, this has always been easier because I always get into trouble um, around close to the crown of my head. So what I've been doing is when I detangle the crown first and detangle from the crown to the middle, then I'm able to brush it through the end a lot easier versus having to brush from the top all the way down on the first go. Things tend to get stuck in the middle anyway, so I'm just combing things in the middle. It does create a big knot, but it's easy to comb that knot out once the bottom half of my hair is detangled. So, I mean, this is what works for me personally. It might not work for you, but I personally think it's great. Alright, so then finally I just brush, I'm able to brush through the whole section from top to bottom. I can get through without running into any tangles anymore. Alright, so now this section is done, my comb is done, and then I turn and now I can turn back the other way, perpendicular to my hair. And this way, the perpendicular way, is supposed to define the curls. So it's not for detangling, apparently. Who knew? It's not for detangling, it's for defining the curls. So it clumps your curls together, it's good for wash and goes. Look at that clump. Ah, oh, that's beautiful. I'm so angry that I've been doing my hair the wrong way. Detangling girls, I've been, I've been natural for close to 10 years, and this was the first time I knew that I was using my Denman brush that I had the whole time I've been natural incorrectly. Again, see, we're putting it the perpendicular way, pumping up those curls. I haven't figured out how to go from purple, from, you know, defined pump Denman brush to wash and go yet, but some people have, so this might be better for you. But again, perpendicular is for defining curls, parallel is for detangling. So to finish up my style, what I do is I split the section and I'm just going to twist it all the way down. So I'm combing out the ends again just to smooth it out. As you twist, sometimes things get naughty again. I finish twisting out that section. And that's basically it. Um, that's how I do my hair. If you like this video, like, subscribe. You know the deal.